Hey, ho, oh la 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 la, oh la 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 la. It is currently 7.30 p.m. I haven't recorded a single second yet today. I've been working a lot, now heading down to Tesco's and continuing to work. So I have absolutely no clue what this episode will hold. I'm testing out the new lounge for recording. The reverberation of the room is pretty crap but I like the space and I like the colors. So since it's Thursday and I did a sort of a Q&A last week, I want to continue and do a retrospective this week because I haven't done it in a while and I feel like I'm drifting away from my initial focus to document my, my path to my success in so many ways. A lot of things happened over the past couple of weeks and a lot of things are going to happen in the next couple of weeks. So I just want to I want to tell you where I'm at right now and what my current goals are. There's so many things happening, I don't even know where to start. Probably the easiest one is the music theme, because that's currently not existing. I've done some recordings, but I'm not happy with them. The DJ theme, however, that's going pretty well. Um, succeeding with the mixes, I published the fourth one, now the fifth one's coming up. Uh, I'm collaborating with DJs, I'm getting noticed, and now I'm planning uh, my first live gig. Just trying all these seats because they're really comfortable and they look good. Tell me which one you prefer. Um, so I'm so nervous about the sound quality. If this is crap, I'm sorry, but I just had to test it out. My work life is catching on. My YouTube life was going back down, but I'm trying to fix that right now. Also, I've started heavily investing time into my own startup because honestly that's what I want to do that's what I believe in and I've neglected it so now uh, I've managed to partner up with some people interesting things are going to happen very very soon and very soon I'm going to be able to talk about what we're doing and invite you along the ride as well very stressful very exciting and I have absolutely no idea how it's going to turn out um, but I'm really hoping that it's gonna be cool, but it's eating up a lot of my brain power. I have to pay attention and it's all my future. If I make a mistake, it's my problem. No one else is, no one else is going to fix it. And that's huge pressure. But again, it's liberating that I, I, I only need to care about my own things, which, which is really cool. Also, judging by the calendar, it's almost summertime and uh, a very long goal and dream of mine was to actually go scuba diving and now I have a couple of friends who are into all these sorts of adventures and we started writing a bucket list of places that we want to go to. One of the first ones is Iceland and recently I discovered that in Iceland you can dive between tectonic plates of Europe and America and I want to do that but I don't have a diving license per se yet. So I started my diving studies, I went through the online course, I'm pretty good in theory. Now I need to put that theory to the test and start doing the practice dives and getting my PADI open water certificate. In the coming weeks I'm going to start doing the course and getting it done so by the time that we go on our little adventures I'll be set. Also, although I want to spend most of the summer in London, because I haven't done that in the past couple of years, I am going to a couple of different places very, very soon, which is very exciting. And there's also a very long inter-European train ride uh, in my future, which I'm really excited about. Even work is pretty exciting, because I'm doing stuff that I haven't done before. I'm balls deep, as I said the other day, into mobile application development right now. I'm creating something for the whole YouTube community and if you're lucky then in the next couple of days I'll have at least a beta version. I'll put all the links below when I have them and I'm hoping that the viewers who also are YouTube creators will benefit from what I'm doing. 
uh, it's just a little something on the side. I'm working on another project that involves mobile development, but since I'm there already, it seems like a good idea. It seemed like a good idea to try and do this as well. So we'll see. If you guys have any questions, use Twitter, that's why it's there. Use the hashtag AskMaza or just mention me or send me a direct message or whatever. I'm going to answer all your questions. Also, I'm semi-active on Snapchat and I'm active on Instagram. Follow me, the handle of both places is VSBMeza. Um, I am posting on Beam too, which I'm still struggling to master because what I, I if I want to Beam something or even if I want to Snapchat something, I'd rather vlog it than I'm still figuring it out. Anyway, on Beam, it's Meza. Uh, I'd love to see you guys there. love to see your reactions to stuff there. So that's it. See you guys tomorrow. Oh, now back home. You know what? I'm actually feeling lucky today. So lucky, in fact, that after a coffee and before I dive balls deep into mobile application development, I'm going to attempt and print off the mix covers that I failed miserably the other day. So, whoo.